Well, Mountbatten is a very unique uh, constituency. We have residents, about half of the voters live in the private estate and another half live in the uh, HDB estates. Within the HDB estate, we have about a small group of uh, residents who live in the rental flats. And these are people that I feel very passionate about. For the past 15 years, what I've done is to reach out to them, reach out to those who are low income, reach out to those who need help and say that, look, talk to me if you need help because we will be able to find means to assist you. So we have uh, the social assistance program for them. We have financial aid programs for them. Uh, every year, every year, uh, my volunteers and I organize a Comcare dinner for them where we invite them, not just them, but their families to come and join us for dinner. So we do this during Chinese New Year, we do this during National Day, we do this during uh, May Day holidays. And, and ultimately, the intent is to reach out to them and say that we care for you. For those who are living in a private estate, uh, I'm really fortunate that uh, many of them, many of you have actually stepped forward to say, what can I do to be counted as a Singaporean? So during the time when we had to move them from Dakota rental flats at Dakota Crescent to the new rental flats at Cassia Crescent, uh, I got many, many volunteers who put up their hands and says, count me in, what can I do to help those in our midst who need help? And that's something we want to encourage among our better off residents because you, you too form part of Singapore, you too are part of our Mountbatten family. I think one of the role of an MP is really to make himself accessible to residents, to people who want their voices to be heard. And that's why I always make myself available. Uh, I meet the people during the Meet the People session every Tuesday. I do uh, house visits almost every week. And, and, and if I'm not doing house visits, I visit the condos to have a chit chat with the residents where I hear the feedback. And I think as a MP, what I try to do is to hear them out and then I work with the various government agencies to make improvements to the infrastructure so that the lives of the residents can be improved. Some of the residents came to see me about five, six years ago and they say that, well, Mr. Lee, my hurt Dakota Crescent will be demolished and we are wanting to push for it to be conserved. So I moved a motion in Parliament when I spoke about it and then I worked with URA, I worked with the Na National Heritage Board and we persuaded HDB to say we will keep six blocks we will keep six blocks and retain them because these features are important. These features represent the heritage of Dakota. And so that to me is important because through good feedback, we can make a change. This coming election, we will be going back to the voters to seek your mandate to have our programs continue. We have worked very hard over the past 15 years and I hope that you continue to support the things that we do. So please, uh, vote for me. Please continue to give me your support. We have many more things that we can do together. I think together we can make a better Singapore. Please vote for me. Thank you.